Good morning, children. Today in maths, we will continue with 3D shapes and learn about prisms and pyramids. Assessment, choose the polyhedra. Yesterday, we learned about polyhedrons, right? So let me check how much you understood about it. Here you can see six different figures. And I want you to choose the polyhedra amongst these. Write the correct answers on your whiteboard. Let's check. Figure A, B, C and E are polyhedrons. Today's lesson objective is to identify similarities and differences between 3D shapes to differentiate prisms and pyramids. Let's revise faces, edges and corners. The flat surfaces around the object is its face. The meeting line of faces are the edges and the corner where the edges meet is called the vertex. Prisms. What is a prism? A three dimensional shape that has identical parallel ends and all flat surfaces. Here you can see a three dimensional shape, identical parallel ends and all flat faces. This is an example of a triangular prism where two triangles are as an ends. One, two and three rectangles as faces. And in rectangular prism that is a cuboid, you can find two rectangles as ends and four rectangles as faces. Types of prisms. The first type is triangular prism. Rectangular prism in that cube and cuboid are rectangular prisms. Then hexagonal prism and pentagonal prisms. Assessment, choose the correct answer. Now, is this a pentagonal prism or a cuboid? Yes, it's a pentagonal prism. Next, is this a rectangular prism or hexagonal prism? Yes, it is a hexagonal prism. Next, is this a rectangular prism or a triangular prism? Correct, it's a rectangular prism. Last one. Is this a pentagonal prism or a triangular prism? Yes, it is a triangular prism. Now, pyramids. A pyramid is a three-dimensional shape which has one base and all other faces are triangles. Here you can see one base and there are three dimensional shape with one base and other faces are triangular shape. This is the edge of the prism and this is the vertex of the prism. A triangular pyramid, its base is triangle and in a square based pyramid, its base is square. Types of pyramids. There are basically three types of pyramids triangular pyramid, square pyramid, and pentagonal pyramid. Triangle pyramid, its base is triangle. Square pyramid, its base is square. And in pentagonal pyramid, 
its base is pentagon pyramids these are the different types of pyramids triangular pyramid square pyramid pentagonal pyramid and hexagonal pyramid tetrahedron polyhedron composed of four triangular faces square pyramid has five faces that is one square and four triangles five vertices and eight edges assessment choose the correct answer first is this a tetrahedron or a cuboid yes it's a tetrahedron second is this a square based pyramid or a pentagonal pyramid correct it's a square based pyramid is this a square based pyramid or a pentagonal pyramid yes it's a pentagonal pyramid last one is it a hexagonal pyramid or a tetrahedron yes it's a hexagonal pyramid let's watch a video on prisms and pyramids now in this lesson we take a look at prisms and pyramids solids are three dimensional shapes 3d now when we talk about 3d we're talking about length width and height okay they are the three dimensions sometimes height is known as depth now a prism has the same shape or cross-section going right through the solid this cross-section gives the prism its name so let's consider this one here so it certainly looks like a few rectangles around that rectangular shape or cross-section goes right through the solid okay so that is known as a rectangular prism now what about this prism well if you look at this area here this cross-sectional area as shown it also goes straight through the solid so it's known as a triangular prism this one here okay we need to look at the base Okay, when we talk about the base, we could also talk about the top of it as well. Five sides, that's uh, a pentagon, isn't it? And that pentagon goes straight through, up and down through the solid. So this one is known as a pentagonal prism. What about this one here? Okay, that area is shaded. And how many sides? Six sides, so it's a hexagon. And we can see that that area also goes right through the solid. So this is known as a hexagonal prism. Now this particular one, all right, looks like it's got squares rather than just rectangles. That square going right through the solid. Okay, if that's the case, it's a cube. Okay, as, as a result, that square needs to go right through from the top to the bottom as well. And also the same square going from one side right through to the other side. Okay, so that's known as a cube. Now a pyramid has a polygon as its base and all of the sides are triangles which meet at a point it is named according to its base so we look at this one the base of it all right all four sides are equal okay it's a square even though the way we draw it it looks like the square is at a bit of an angle okay that's the way we draw it but it is a square base so it's known as a square pyramid this pyramid okay as its base is a rectangle so it's known as a rectangular pyramid this one as its base is a triangle so it's known as a triangular pyramid and another word for triangular pyramid is a tetrahedron this pyramid what has it got as its base if you look at it how many sides one two three four five six six sides it's a hexagon so it's known as a hexagonal pyramid. Excellent. Well, that concludes the lesson. Good luck with your questions. Assessment. Name these shapes. I want you to write the names 
on your whiteboard. The first one, the first shape is a square based pyramid. And the second one is cone. How are they same? They both have a base and an apex. How are they different? One has curved edge and other has straight edges. Now draw two shapes in this Carol diagrams. Polyhedron, not a polyhedron. I want you to draw two polyhedrons and two shapes which are not polyhedrons. Let's check. These are the two polyhedrons and these are not a polyhedron. Now label this Carol diagram. I want you to identify these four shapes and write their names above it. What do we call such type of shapes? These are the prisms and these are not a prism. Let's summarize today's lesson. Different ways to classify 3D shapes. The number of faces, the shapes of the faces, number of edges, the number of vertices, whether they are polyhedra, whether they are prisms, and whether they are pyramids. Prisms and pyramids. These are the different prisms, triangular prism, square prism, rectangular prism, pentagonal prism, hexagonal prism, and octagonal prism. These are the different pyramids. Triangular pyramid, square pyramid, rectangular pyramid, pentagonal pyramid, hexagonal pyramid, and octagonal pyramid. Thank you, children.